How to speak up. Perhaps one reason that women cower from expressing opinions in meetings and in general is that they fear they will be perceived as wrong, or even worse, just some stupid girl. Speaking up is not about being right, but about helping everyone get to the right answer, and that answer is likely a combination of everyone's ideas. If you are concerned about being wrong, or if you only speak when you think someone will praise you, I challenge you to shift your mentality. You do not have to be right all the time. Your ultimate goal should be to exercise your intellect and contribute to the group goal. Of course, there are optimal ways to speak up. Be prepared when you speak up. The best ideas service and important messages are heard when expressed in a manner that a, the recipient is willing to listen to with an open mind, b, are in a format that penetrates a, this is the way we've always done it, corporate culture, and c, are argued objectively and professionally, not emotionally. Naturally, passion is important, but we can get so worked up about our message that we jump too early to communicate it. I have done this many times. I'll get an idea and run into my boss's office to share it, but the idea gets buried in my enthusiasm because I have not expressed the idea clearly, have not articulated its benefits, or even thought through potential problems. I make no sense whatsoever and get the glazed eye stare from my boss. Learn from my mistakes. Before you jump into communication, process your thoughts, prepare your message, validate your points with facts, plan your delivery, anticipate potential questions, and be prepared with answers. Whatever you want to communicate, let your emotions die down and plan your delivery so your boss appreciates your opinion or idea as much as you do.